So here we are back in the iways U5 and I just want to show you the menu. I turned off the heating so we don't have all the noise. And this is the menu and there's no you cannot scroll. This is this is all you got. And you know here's the vehicle control which has all these funny functions and this is really hilarious because it will just open all the windows with a button press. Um, and as you can see, yeah, the the, the translation is uh, not ideal. Um, I can I can back up the car a little bit to show you. Oh no, I actually I have to. Um, so that's also yeah, you cannot drive away when you're not in this wearing the seat belt. Anyway, so here. For example, you have what I was talking about, the regeneration. What is really nice is this electric power steering because it was on the light, uh, it was in the light setting before and that was just personally, I, I couldn't handle it. Uh, but if you take it, um, if you switch it to heavy, then suddenly it is great. Um, yeah, most of these warnings I just shut off. Um, and um, that will actually make your life uh, just a bit more relaxed if you look at the settings menu then yeah you can control the system brightness but I would like to also be able to shut down the screen and as far as I found out there's no way to do this and it's also hard to get it to, to a level of brightness that is um, nicer in the evening so my trick was to have this setting on all the time because now it's actually dimming more than you can get done in ev any different uh, any other setting so if we look at the speedometer over here it has a couple of different looks that I can show you and yeah most of them are a bit strange so I just took the classic one and when you look at this gum, you can see it predicts 123 kilometers with just 32%. And here we can see what I just had as last statistics with the vehicle. And the thing is just that the gum that shows us 123 right now will just lie in your face at pretty much any given moment. So the thing is that you just have to only watch the percentage because that is actually real and the gum is not real so yeah be prepared it will show you an unattainable amount of kilometers which in my opinion is incredibly dangerous to do i hope they will fix it in a future update but it's too early to tell if that will happen i have a feeling it won't um the great thing is that you have the percentage right here and it's true and it is not it will not ch if even if it shows you 10 percent it won't just drop to zero i got it to three percent to four percent on long traveling because i knew that the consumption was on, on the right level to continue at the speed i was doing so i've been very impressed with the battery in general because it has just been uh, working really well and yeah to my surprise actually it was able to sustain high speed at low uh, state of charge levels and then yeah you get the best fast charging when you get to the low level uh, and the only thing that happened is that the gum stopped predicting any kilometers that you could still do when you reach the five percent level but that's not a problem because you know that five percent will give you you know anywhere between 10 15 kilometers depending on how you've been driving um so yeah if we talk about range in winter uh, realistically about 250 kilometers is uh, is easily done but anything more than that will involve serious hyper miling um that i yeah i personally love but you might not like it so much as you can see i taped off the camera that's over there and here there's 
something that I have to show you because these LED lights that are behind the black part over there, uh, there's maybe 40 orange LEDs and they light up when there's a vehicle next to you. And I put some tape on this one to try. Uh, the dimming feature that I personally would like more is just to have one small light warning you uh, of stuff like this happening and there's so many lights that uh, it's just too much but as you can see yeah the the look and feel of this vehicle of this vehicle is pretty luxurious and it's pretty spacious and the mirror is also yeah it uh, has no no uh, border as you can see so yeah i i really like a lot of the features in this car people in the back can sit comfortably as long as they're not over 101 meter 90 um, because i've had a friend of two meters tall in the back and his head was a little bit squashed so yeah uh, depending on your length that might be um, not good enough for you i cannot decide look at this gorgeous jaguar over there many different colors as you can see available this blue also looks pretty damn gorgeous so yeah the iways u5 spending some days with it